Hello everyone, this is Lori, also known as Organic Granny here. Gonna give you a quick demonstration of my Needlework System 4 table lap stand. Uh, this is part of the Needlework System Flow, uh, Needlework System 4 uh, stand system. There's actually four different bases and then they all go with the four different heads. So I have previously done a video on my floor stand and so I will link to that below. Uh, I'm not going to uh, review that. Uh, that is in another video. So what comes with the table lap stand and uh, I apologize I'm probably going to use I'll probably call it a lap stand one time and a table stand the other time, but that's what it is. It is a table slash lap stand. So what comes, um, all the bases come separately, all the heads come separately, so you can mix and match to what you, what suits you. What comes with the lap stand is uh, the base, and it's very, very light, and then this arc and then the two knobs that one attaches to the base and one attaches to, uh, to the head. This allows for um, quite a bit of flexibility. I mean, you can, and actually this would come off. You could actually use this on your floor stand if you wanted to. Uh, so this um, all comes apart. It's very, very well crafted and made in the USA. Uh, actually, uh, Needlework System 4 is in uh, Ormond Beach, Florida. Um, they don't actually, you can't buy directly from the manufacturer, but you can buy from your local Needlework store. Your LNS would be more than happy to order one for you, or you can find LNSs online that would also ship one to you. Okay, so. As I said, extremely light, well made. This is uh, aluminum and it's got little rubber feet on the bottom to help it from skidding. Okay. And what I would do to use my clamp, and I use this, this is the, um, this is the frame clamp. It will actually accommodate uh, any, and I, I apologize, I didn't grab a hoop, any, uh, any sized hoop or frame. I mean, this widens to a couple inches, so you can slide any frame in there or any hoop. I use this with my hoop. And so what you do is you attach, you slide that on. And this has actually, I don't know if I'm going to be able to show you, well, but there are little grooves. Let's see if we can do that. See right here? These are all grooves. These are little teeth. And then there's little teeth on here. So then when you when you mesh them together, the the teeth lock. And when you tighten the nut, it keeps the head from sliding. It's extremely well designed. So basically we're gonna spin that on really quick. Okay, and then you would put your hoop in here and you would be able to stitch, stitch two-handed. Now, I like using this um, on a table and I also enjoy using this on, um, on my couch. I put my, prop my feet up on an ottoman and I put this on my lap and it works perfect. Okay, thoroughly, thoroughly enjoy this. I am so glad I made the investment to the base. Okay, so... If you were going to attach, and I have my, um, I have my Q-snap attachment here, and I'll just show you how that goes on, and I'm going to demonstrate really quick how to put the Q-snaps in the Q-snap attachment. Now, I'll be the first to admit this is fiddly, okay? This is a little bit cumbersome. Uh, you definitely want to do this on a table. So this actually expands and accommodates a very wide Q-snap. And then 
these rotate around and let you flip to the back side. Okay, so let me see if I can get this in here really quick, just to show you. Oh, let's do it this way. So you would slide your key snap in here. You would of course put your put your fabric in first. Um, you don't have to to tighten tighten it. In fact, if you want to, you can just uh, when you're done for the evening, you can just loosen your fat. You know, just twist your Q snaps a little bit and loosen your fabric. It is not necessary for you to take this off every single day. Okay, I left mine in for three years, so. Um, but that's another story. Okay, so, so now you have this mounted. Okay, and this will spin. This allows you to get to both sides. All right, and then you would take this whole thing and attach it here. Okay, and if anything, what we would do is we want one to, oh, you need to make an adjustment, so you just move that, loosen this up. And this down here also has the teeth. Okay, so you just tighten that up a little bit, put it where you need to put it, and you're gonna slide that on there. Okay, so what we wanna do is we wanna don't grind the teeth together. That's very hard on the device. Okay, so there we go. And so now you can actually stitch on both sides. Okay, you can stitch and then you can flip it over to finish off. Now it's, it's loose, but it's not, um, I feel it's tight enough because generally you're holding, you know, you're holding the frame on both sides with your wrists. So, but this is, it swings very easily, but it also then stays in place. Uh, as an added bonus, I'm going to throw in what I have found is the ultimate light for this. And that is a Ikea. I don't know how to pronounce that. That's okay. J-A-N-S-J-O. Okay, what this is, is it's a clip-on light. It's extremely sturdy, except what I do not recommend is you open up these, the clamp really, really super wide and then let go of it. What'll happen is you'll snap, you'll snap one of the pieces off. Ask me how I know. So anyways, this I have found is a very, it's got lots of, don't know if it's going to say real quick. It has 11 feet, 6 inches, or 3.5 meters of cord. So uh, it is wonderful. It has an on-off switch here. And has lots and lots and lots of cord. And so basically, hopefully y'all will be able to see this. I clip this on my stand here. I also clip it on my frame clamp, okay? And it goes right there and it's not going anywhere. And this is very, uh, you can point it anywhere that you want to. I uh, just thought I'd throw that in there that this is absolutely a wonderful light. Doesn't have anything to do with the needlework system floor, four, but I just thought I'd throw that in. This is an Ikea product. You can also order it on Amazon. All right, uh, if you have any questions, please don't hesitate to uh, ask me below. Um, I will link to the other, um, the other floor stand that I have. Uh, 
I love this system. This is not an inexpensive system. It may be cost prohibitive, but if you are going to do a lot of traveling, I highly recommend this. Now this will fold flat in the bottom of your suitcase, no problem. This comes off, just fold it, throw it in the bottom of your suitcase, throw your clothes on it, and away you go. And it's, it's very light. I, I'm sorry I did not weigh it, but um, you know, it's, it's not that heavy. Alrighty, if there's anything else I can uh, answer for you, don't hesitate to write below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible. Have a lovely evening. See you soon.